Alright guys, my name is Fiends, and today I have another three PvP matches. Well, this is only going to be three because I only have, well, one of them is a pretty short one, so it's going to just fly through it. I Plus, I might even um, speed through it a little bit or speed it up. Um, so, uh, but yeah, so what is special about today's, as you can probably tell from the title, it is going to be against a full team of Megas. We got a Mega Metagross, Ho-Oh, Tyranitar, Latia, Zapdos, and Dragonite is Lord John's team. So here we go. I, I, I'm i actually kind of surprised that I won this. It was two days ago, but I was like, I need to make a video on this. This is really good. <laughs> um, <clears throat> so I swapped with that Kyogre to absorb the Ice Punch as always, and I do that double swap to the um, Zapdos to absorb the Thunder Punch that he has to throw at me. So, um, you know, pretty decent damage um, that I just took because it was basically nothing. So I go straight for the Heat Wave. Um, he swaps the Tyranitar. Obviously, I don't want to stay in there. Um, my goal there was just to um, get rid of the... Uh, get rid of the... Um, a sandstorm there but he ended up swapping out anyway so um, I was like maybe he's gonna predict me going to the what's it called again um, the uh, Zapdos so I stayed in hit him with the Scald but he ended up just using the Thunder Punch again so um, I just leave him my on it or my Steelix um, I hit him with the Crunch because you know that's super effective against the Metagross but um, I I found out that he had leftovers so I was like well there's no point in me just using Crunch um, so I, I, I hope I can get like a quick or something um, and I actually did so um, for whoever I'm gonna swap into next I think it's Kyogre um, I'll he won't have the multi scale so I will be able to deal with that so I got pretty lucky there I mean it would have been um, better with the flinch I actually swapped into Dragonite oh well um, it probably would have been better with a flinch obviously but um, oh well um, so unfortunately I didn't get that kill um, with the uh, the what's it called the um outrage which is kind of unfortunate um but my kyogre outsped it anyway wow um so uh here we go we got the metagross i'm like all right what's he gonna do here he ends up just going for the meteor mash i was kind of like just cutting my losses there i didn't really think i would be able to do <clears throat> do much with uh, the kyogre but i'm like i'm probably gonna outspeed i already have a decent amount of damage on this thing so um I'm just going to hit him with that Earthquake, see how it goes, and of course I take him out. So here I'm like, alright, if I'm going to take this thing out, I just, I can't, I can't afford to use a, um, use a, a Hone Claws, I, 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 because I knew he had Ice Beam, so, um, there was, he was either going to take me out or put me really low, but I wasn't really willing to take the chance, um, so, uh, here we go. He's got that hidden power ice. Of course, it's a Zapdos. Um, but as always, my gear team is a tank, especially now that he's blue plus one. Um, but here I'm like, you know what? I might as well just um, toxic this thing um, because uh, um, uh, pff, I just completely lost my train of thought. But he ends up using the um, Swords Dance, and because he has Quick Claw, it made it look like he might, he outsped me, but I was like, there's no way that he's going to outspeed me. So I ended up just taking him out with the um, with the Aura Sphere there, and so his setup was just like completely negated. So um, he just goes for a Drill Pack that actually did a decent amount of damage. Um, I was kind of surprised, um, but I did put up the uh, Toxic. Um, it seemed all of his team, or all... All of the um, Megas on his team all had gold berries instead of miracle berries, except for maybe one. So it's kind of confusing why he would do that. I was really confused, to be completely honest. But um, he just went for the drill peck again. <clears throat> and, uh, uh, excuse me, I keep clearing my throat. Um, but the Toxic ends up taking him out there. So the last one I had to deal with is the ho -Oh. And I'm like, I know this thing might have recover, and it most likely will. And I don't know how um, reliable it, my Zapdos and um, uh, Garchomp are going to be. So I ended, I ended up just toxicing it. Um, I didn't really want to toxic spam, but I ended up doing it just to make sure that I cl uh, I clinched the win because there was no way that I was going to let uh, a six mega team slip away from me like that. So. Once I got that toxic damage on, I'm like, all right, this has got to be game. So um, I wasn't sure if he had recover or not, but I hit him with the shadow force anyway, um, and he uses the recover. So um, I was glad that I got that toxic damage on because um, it, he probably would have 
cause me a lot of trouble um, if I didn't if I didn't put a the toxic on him. So um, of course he's just going to go for that recover stall it out as much as possible. But because I have leftovers, the um, damage is just not going to be enough on me, and the toxic damage is going to take him out. So that was awesome. I can't believe I finally got six megas taken down. Oh my gosh! So <clears throat> I actually shared this one. Um, this next one. Um, I do have to show the other one, but this one is five megas, and I also won this one. So it's this is just like destroying all these mega teams. Like it's it's insane. I've been doing, I've been like killing it in PvP lately, but unfortunately, I haven't really been finishing in first places because I always miss a day or two, or it tends to be like one day of the week, just because of like I don't know, like a, a game or something. I'm not really too sure. Like not like a a game game, but like a like a sport event kind of thing, you know what I'm trying to say. So um, here I'm like, I, I just want to, I don't want him to set up, so I hit him with that taunt as always. Um, that's just what I do with my um, Steelix. That is probably his main cause now other than the Dragonites, but I don't really see them too often anymore. So it's kind of it's kind of interesting. Um, it, it's, it's really been a crazy ride with the Steelix. He's been there since like day one. It's like crazy. Um, but uh, here he goes for that Ice Punch, takes out my Dragonite. I don't blame him. I was kind of thinking maybe I would outspeed him, but I ended up not outspeeding him. So, um, so here I just went for the... Um, the uh, Giratina, I was assuming that he would have Sturdy, so I just hit him with the Aura Sphere first, and then I went for the Shadow Force, but it didn't. It really didn't even matter because the Shadow Force didn't take him out. So I go for the Shadow Force this time, um, because I'm like, well, I'm probably gonna, I'm gonna take him out anyway, so I'm probably just gonna get even more health back from my leftovers if I use Shadow Force. So that was why I did that. I knew I would have been able to take him out any other way, but I was like. Oh, maybe this actually will pay off um, because he didn't crit me, but I don't know if he would have crit me if it would have taken me out or not. But unfortunately, I didn't take out the Weavile, which is really unfortunate. Um, I actually found out that uh, Weavile's uh, special defense RVs are 100, so um, it's better than his physical attack. So, um, But uh, yeah, I live that Night Slash because my Kyogre has gotten insanely good. Um, but uh, yeah, so I... I take him out luckily and I'm like this should be a pretty fairly simple now um, now that that a major threat is gone to the Weavile but um, <clears throat> oh, <it's, laughs> um, but uh, here I'm like all right might as well hit him with that ice beam hopefully I was B I did of course um, I think this if I ever once I get him to a purple he's just gonna be outspeeding basically almost everything but um, my first purple mega I always thought that it would be um, uh, that it would be a Garchomp, but this Kyogre is just proving to be insane. So, unfortunately, I didn't take him out with that Thunderbolt the first time, but he didn't take me out with the, um, with the, what's it called, uh, with the, um, shoot, what's it called, um, oh my god, with the, uh, the Thunderbolt, or I was able to outspeed him, so, um, so here, this is where it gets close. So I was like, maybe I'm gonna outspeed this thing, um, just because uh, he I move I went first that first turn, but he ended up using counter. So I was like, shoot, this is gonna be kind of rough. Um, so he hits me with that flamethrower. I hit him with the dragon rush, um, or I either set up again, but I'm pretty sure I go for a dragon rush here. Um, yeah, so I go for the dragon rush. I'm like, all right, that's not gonna do much damage. So um, I knew that if I wanted to take him out in the next turn, I would need to. To, uh, use another home clause and I was like I know that I'm gonna live this because um, the sunlight is no longer there and there might be a, a, like he can't crit me or anything so unfortunately I didn't take him out and I'm like all right leftovers please be enough to keep me alive but unfortunately it wasn't and he lived on such a little health but unfortunately I didn't get that win um, you know, I was gonna, I was planning on showing you this one. Um, it was another like five mega team. This guy just ran away though, but I might as well just not show that one um, because I mean it's approaching ten minutes. It's a long enough video, so. Um, but yeah, I know it's not the super the most energetic video of uh, all of them, but um, I knew that I wanted to make this video, so. Um, 
Uh, I'm going to be making some pretty good ones in the future though, um, so stay tuned for that. I have, um, I think the last video that I posted, the three megas, or like the best three ones, that one is going to be coming up soon. That's going to be a pretty cool video, like a, a nice project to do, so um, look forward to that. But um, yeah guys, other than that, my name is Faints on behalf of Master Guild. Server 39, um, actually, I kind of mess that up. Um, like and subscribe if you are new. It would be greatly, greatly appreciated. <laughs> um, but other than that, my name is Faints. I'm behalf of Master Guild, Server 39, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.